Hi guys and welcome back to Homemade by Sibo. So today I'm bringing you guys a haul. Um, it's mostly homeware stuff. Some stuff I thrifted, some um, obviously homeware. I've got quite, um, not quite a bit. I've got a little bit of homeware stuff that is new and I also have my order is finally delivered from my winnings of last year, November sometime. Um, of uh, you remember you guys I want to give away 65k worth of a giveaway so some of my winnings actually I think that was the last thing that I uh, was waiting for from my winnings um, from Peterson and Leonard so it got delivered but I'm not gonna show you guys I'm gonna show you like to show like this is what I got like but sort of like a sneak peek you know but um, I'm not really gonna be showing like full-blown show because I don't want to make a separate video when I'm actually styling for the stuff so yeah and actually my lamp got um, damaged and they are sending a replacement so most probably by the time that um, lamp is delivered I am gonna be done with that yeah yeah something like that um, but anyways oh and yeah no um let's just get right into the video you guys but first first i just want to say um welcome and thank you uh so much for clicking this video please don't forget to like it and to share and for those that haven't subscribed please do subscribe to this channel i know it's quite small most people they like to subscribe on you know uh content creators that are already fully developed but in order for us small ones to get there we need your support as well so i would really really appreciate if you click the subscribe button down below and become part of this growing family but yeah let's get right into the video so i'm just first gonna start with the um homework stuff you guys first of all from my winnings from i think it was what was it hmm net florist yeah uh, from net florist um i ended up getting myself this uh candle i got two of them the other one i'm actually using it in my dining room so i got two of these uh shallow rice uh, uh candles they're quite well this is the number 17. Uh, i got two of them and because this is actually a hole, I want to see how it smells like. Because I'm not just going to be holding stuff and not know how it actually smells like. Okay. Mm, it actually smells so good. So good. I wish they actually have them in bigger sizes. I don't know if they do sell them in bigger sizes, but this number se se 17, it smells so good. Oh my god, it smells really, really good, you guys. It's a very tiny candle, like, this much, this big, like, seriously. But it is really good. It smells really, really nice. I like that. And then another um, candle that I got, I got a candle from Woolies. It's the Begamot and Jasmine Cocoa Wax Candle. It's this one. Um, funnily enough, I didn't even smell it at the shop, which is weird because I do like to smell stuff before I buy them. Ooh. Oh my God, this is for a bedroom or, or a bathroom for self-care Sundays. It's got this nice freshness. Ooh, it's like mm, relax, but it's not like in your face, in your face type of scent. It's very nice, fresh, subtle scent. I, I love it. I love it for a bedroom just to give it that fresh feel or if you want to relax maybe say for instance you've got a um diffuser and essential oil diffuser as well running in the background and then just for ambiance and jay you just light up a candle this is the one it's really also nice and then from Pedersen and leonard um i already opened the box because i wanted to see what was in the stuff i got um some posters If I can get to open this okay so I got some posters there's four posters inside and and this is how they look like it's a wooden top here and then at the bottom this is how it looks like and it's got the the Peterson and Leonard um, sort of like a star or what do you call cross type of sign 
on it and there's um there are actually four and then you get one of the wooden um um i think this is uh what do you call this type of wood i think it's um oak i think it's oak yeah so that's really nice i can just you know when you stack it up and then once you yeah something like that <laughs> we'll see when i'm i'm styling with it okay and then again from peterson and leonard i have these they are called isindu spoons so if you go into their website you will see the prices i'm not gonna be mentioning prices you guys but if you do go onto the uh, Peterson and Leonard website, you can see the stuff. These are the spoons. I actually love them. The other ones, they have a sort of like twisted somewhere here. I can't even recall how they look like, but this is how these ones look like. I feel like this would be great for um, salads, you know, in a salad bowl or something. But I feel like they would be the very, very nice salad bowls. Like... Yeah, and this sort of like spatula, I don't know, I think it can be decorative as well. One day, one day with my kitchen. <laughs> okay, moving on, I have these placemats, which I got from Checkers. These, I can actually tell you, these are 130 rands per set. They come in twos. These are the um, forage and feast um from the uh brand this new this is a new brand from um checkers you guys this is a new checkers brand it's called forage and feast so i got um six of them so it's just three sets and the they are six i'm actually thinking of getting four more because i don't know how my um outdoor dining um is how big it will be so i want to have at least enough for when that happens but in the meantime i'll be using the ones that i have but i want to be able to get uh, more so in terms of that whenever i buy placements i'm thinking that i'm gonna be buying placements in tens um so yeah and oh sorry guys and again from checkers i can't even remember how much this was um i bought this um water set it's a five piece water set it's a um, uh, harafe and uh, four um, four glasses. So yeah, this is how it basically looks like. Um, those are the glasses. I feel like they would be nice when um, um, somewhere on a counter, you know. And then, oh, I can't even open this. I have to take everything out. But this is how it looks on the outside, you guys. So, yeah. That's that. And then, again, for homeware, I also bought these. It's also um, the from the Checkers range, Forage and Feast. I got this uh, cleaver knife this thing is gorgeous you guys if you haven't started buying this brand from checkers please don't look at look at us sideways once we have the sets and everything is looking all nice and bougie in our homes and stuff like that you know when we start using our things and you are like what do what does people get these things we get them from checkers um but yeah it's it is so gorgeous you guys this thing is beautiful this is how it looks on the inside it's really really gorgeous i love it and let me just take it out it's really gorgeous it comes in a sleeve and on my chopping board oh it might push up block ah baby and luckily i've got a um one of those sharpening stones my husband got from my father-in-law so we've got one of those so it's just gonna be sharpening and sharpening and sharpening and you know do it old school but this is how the spoons look like quite huge as well Ooh. this is how it looks like it's got the forage um and feast thingy at the back and stainless steel it's quite huge and very very beautiful i love this for me <laughs> and then um also on home way i have this 
kettle it's the le crochet um kettle it's the whistling one it's also quite big i think it was i can't even remember how many liters this is but uh because they didn't have the meringue i love the meringue color in the le crochet range i really really love the meringue because i feel like i'm not like i do like color but i also don't like color if you get if you get what i mean you will get me i do love color but not too much color especially in my kitchen I, I i love it to be neutral i feel like the meringue would uh in the le crochet it would suit me well when it comes to my kitchen but i opted for this one it is quite big oh it's a 2.1 liters so it's it's quite huge you guys really really big and yeah i'm super excited for this we are using gas so this was the reason why i bought um this one and i'm just gonna put it on the side and then um something that is thrifted i bought myself this little table thing i loved the legs i love the fact that it's still got that you know um solid solid wood but the top is quite damaged it looked like it was left outside i got it for a hundred rand it was 150 so i negotiated my way down got it for 100 i love the legs i will see if i can just stain them and just seal them off and do something at the top and possibly on the sides as well i'm gonna be giving it a new look altogether. so i'm super excited for this as i said i got it for 100 rand and then i also something that's also thrifted i bought these frames for 150 rand a piece i love them especially because i love blues but that's not to say that my um uh, kitchen in in my kitchen my um homeware kitchen stuff is gonna be blue here blue there red yellow no uh-uh mm -mm. my pots uh-uh so this is where i'm gonna be incorporating color this piece it's gonna go into the kids bathroom both of them and this is the other one. Oh my woo, woo. my leg you guys oh my leg woo, my leg okay this is the other piece i don't know if you guys can oh my gosh let me just pick this one up if you can see it you see it but you can't see me now but this is the other piece it was also 150 right i am really really excited for them so yeah and then the other thing that i got for me i got myself um two pairs of um sunnies true story true story eh? so oh my gosh my leg you guys it's i sat on it but now now that it's straight oh my god Woo, jehovah jaira Woo, my leg oh my gosh mm. okay let me see if i can sit like this you guys uh -uh okay let's see shift and shade okay so a true story is um we were having a briny with the kids and the hamster so we were just sitting outside and then it started raining and i went to the laundry because i wanted to put some um laundry inside the machine and i left my glasses with the my normal prescription glasses i left them with the hamster and i said please hang on to this for me and then him and my daughter they were having a chat started raining they got up boom my glasses fell he stepped on them shakaraka so they are basically down and out but i can still use them because i had to try you know and squeeze and i'm only due for my um eye test and new lenses this year in september so when i found my optometrist she said that, uh we can only um, the medical aid is only covering them in September and right now. So, quick fix. Okay? Only for during the day, but at night I can wear those because very at night they are in some morning. So, and that's no lie. I can't see at night. This eye, the left one, has actually been troubling me lately. So, I need to go in and just get my eyes um, tested uh, on my pocket, of course, so that I don't have things with the medical aid and then get to have at least some uh, prescribed eye drops for this eye so i got sunnies for that <laughs> yeah, baby so i went to Saint last part of course and i got myself these babies mm -hmm. sorry about that so i got myself these this is the first pair 
um, their products. Don't ask me how much these are. Unless if you want to, if you are curious, if you are curious, you just go to the website. I'm not mentioning five prices here. The only prices I'll mention is this one's 430 rands. The other ones. <laughs> okay, so this is how they look like. I love, love, love these. The frame, it's got a, um, a blush, pink type or nude type of a, a color and then white at the bottom. And I like the fact that on the sides, if you can check the side, it's not, um, the frame is quite small. I don't love, I don't like sunnies that are like this big and then you get the um, um, the name of the, uh, the brand name on the side being like in your face. These ones, they are just the right, you know, they've got the right amount of, uh, um, but I love them. Oh guys, uh, ask and bones. Hey, and no bone pen. Listen. La, the misses oh but anyways i do love them very very much i saw others about home food how i like it jehovah gyro but anyways i do love my sunnies and then the other pair um the other pair i bought it um also from santa's heart but they had to ship this one because they didn't have it in stock in the store so they shipped it and it's this one. And every woman needs a black per uh, type of sun is because I mean they go with mostly everything. And the other one, it actually is nice, especially for when you're wearing white or flowy dresses, you know, mixy dresses. Or even shorts, Jay. They they are good for the, even this one. It's black. We'll go with everything. So this is the case. It's like your normal type of case, like when you get your prescription glasses type of case. So there's nothing special about that. And then this is how they look like. And the sides. See, this 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 is just me. You see how small that is and actually they are logo as well on the side the it's not the type of in your face type of thing to say that i'm wearing designer uh -uh. I, I don't like that me i do not like that but this is how they look like and on my face one day one day if you are not following me on instagram you won't see the pictures when i've taken nice pictures with when i'm uh, um, repeating my clothes to show that i'm the owner of this uh, clothes <laughs> i saw that audio you guys about um um you know when it's evidence when i'm when you see me wearing the same clothes it's evidence that i'm the owner so yeah evidence that i'm the owner so yeah these is how these ones look like like it's giving rich anti vibes or is it not <laughs> except that this this auntie is not rich she's she's just She's living in 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 God's mercies. Pilem saying, guys. Pilem saying. So, yeah. Marantik. But yeah, I do love them. These ones are very very dark. I like that. The other ones, they have that. Um, they do protect my eyes. I'll say that. But these, I love both of them. I'll say that. I think my next ones, I'll have to swallow. I don't know swallow what, because I want those Tom Ford ones. Oh my God. <laughs> okay so um anyways you guys i'm gonna quickly go and show you the other things which is a lamp and a couch not show i'm just gonna give you a sneak peek and then you will have to watch my next video when i'm styling the um the items you guys but yeah if you have gotten up until this far thank you so very much for being here and for those that have subscribed as well thank you for joining the family and welcome and also please don't forget to smash the like button and um share the videos my videos i do diys here i do gardening i do what else home related content like um life styling like these about holes and what what so just feel at home and don't forget to comment Pella, and just tell me what did you like what did you like how i would do this and do that like if i talk too much say i see boy i could do my shame <laughs> but yeah let me go and show you um the other stuff you guys and with after that, I will see you on my next video. Bye, guys. Okay, guys. So I just quickly came to show you guys the couch. 
and it's just one pouch you guys because it's such a pricey piece it in itself and because i didn't get you know a lot of vouchers on it so i managed to get just the one piece and this is the sneak peek basically you will have to wait and see how it looks like and then here is the lamp but unfortunately with the lamp it came broken and they have to um take it back they've already actually sent uh curia to come and fetch this one and they've already uh placed a replacement they just have to ship it now but yeah once they've uh once they have uh, shipped it and then I will do the styling video for you guys but it's actually such a beautiful beautiful piece you guys the lampshade luckily it was inside the the box or that came with the um, the couch and it didn't uh, get broken so they're only gonna replace the lamp and not the lampshade as well so yeah that's that okay before I forget this is the type of wood that they used to protect the piece itself I like this because see what's got new wood to play with now you guys um i've got these little pieces it's super wood and the um i can't remember what the name of this board is called but yeah i've got two of them because one was for the top and the other one was for the bottom and then all these um super wood pieces here so yeah i'm super excited for that i'm just gonna disassemble them and keep them in my storeroom so that they are nicely protected until i need them 